do you want me to do you want me to just read read the notes off first? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay. So the notes I had, I had three notes that came to mind is how do you deal with Falco full hop back turn? Okay. When they're just when they have their back turn and they're full hopping constantly. Yeah. Um how do you deal with non fastball and undershot aerials? Oh, it's a good one. Yeah. And then when the Falco is hard camping what do you do? And this just doesn't have to be, this doesn't have to be just specifically lasers. If they're just yeah hard camping, they're just not going to commit. They are right, like stubborn right. as hell like crazy. Yeah. Okay. That's okay. good. That's good. Really good questions. Okay. Yeah. Good snatch the eye by Wizzy on the downer. Oh, let me lower this. What'd you say? A good smash DI by uh Yeah, yeah, Turner. yeah. Pretty good, yeah, yeah. No, he did that stomp though. Mm -hmm. That's kinda it's interesting to do against Falco though for sure. Yeah, yeah, I was wondering about this. So pause for a sec. Mm -hmm. Is it still as effective to do to do that type of pullback stomp on Falco? It's it's not generally, but um you it, it's worth throwing out early to see if they, you know, if they run into it, right? Mm -hmm. You know, that's the thing. That's the beautiful thing about that move is you just get to see if it works. And if it works, it works, you know? Mm -hmm. So I, that's why he's doing it early. And we'll see how Wes adapts, you know? But, um, yeah, just... I mean, he's to totally noncommittal. But if, if Wes decided to nair in there, he would have gotten a, a trade stomp and, right? That's it's, the kind of thing about space animals is that, like, you're never going to know when they're going to approach. Like, you never know for sure, right? Mm -hmm. So just doing it is just like a, you know. And it's he's so safe, you know. It's, he's not going to get punished for doing that stomp. Yeah, like, is it, like, fine if they're not, like, lasering? Is that where yeah, exactly, the stomp yeah. becomes more effective? Because that's the first thing that comes to mind is that if they laser, that's when the stomp doesn't really pressure. become. Yeah, for it, sure. It doesn't really work. Exactly, yeah. So, yeah. Usually, I will say, though, usually Falcons go laser right there. So, one second. Okay. Yeah, Falcons usually do laser there, but... Okay. Okay. Oh, that was insane. Look at this. Wes just, like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, my God. That was that's really insane. smart. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Was he's uh, using this platform right here, right? Yep, under under kind the plat, of... similar to the left and set. Yeah, where he's just under plat. Yeah, and then you see West Falls also. So go back, the, pretty much so, right here. This is pretty much exactly yeah. what I'm talking yeah. about. They'll do this to a full hop thing, and they'll pretty much hard yeah. camp under the platform themselves. So like to so go on. Yeah, a that's bit. rough. Yeah, so go that's on a little fucking bit rough because he does another full hop exactly yeah. like that so right what would be the way to counter that because i mean they have like pretty much all like the air superiority in the world pretty much like, yeah because if they if they if i narrow to try to catch the landing downer yeah. probably wins out right right yes you don't want to you don't want that trade um but i will say this is you can be patient right Mm -hmm. You don't have to find the answer right away. Like you can just stay under the platform yourself, right? Generally, like, um, yeah, stay under the platform yourself and look for something you feel like you can really punish. Like, if they full hop, um, you're you're safe under this platform, right? Mm -hmm. So just know that, you know. Just know, just know where you're safe if they full hop at, at an angle, right? Mm -hmm. like no... you're safe on the, there's you're safe on top of this left platform you're safe under it right mm -hmm. what, what gets you what might get you in trouble is if you're dash dancing un under the platform the reason why dash dancing on the platform is risky is because they can change their timing up on that back air so much mm -hmm. right they can do it like so, early or they can do it late yeah exactly so look how wizzy's moving he's not necessarily dash dancing right yeah, under so the platform there, so Nair, empty hop, one baby dash dance, but that's it. Yeah, one little baby dash dance. That's not even like a big one, you know? Mm -hmm. But, like, keep in mind, like, the movement here has to be, like, um, to where, uh, yeah, 
basically, yeah, you don't want to get caught in a, in a in a in a situation where you're where you need dash dance to outspace them, you know. So is it like out to basically like outside of the Falco zone? If that yeah, makes yeah, sense. So like exactly, stay, yeah. So stay outside the zone. Yeah, stay outside the zone, and um, if if you know if you can punish it with a dash dance, great. But I mean, if if it happens, but it's it's hard, you know. Mm-hmm. So that's why the jumping here is nice. You know, you can use the platform slide under, you know. Uh, Wizzy almost does it with a back air, right? Yeah, it trades with up tilt. It just trades, you know. It's really unfortunate, but, you know, that's that's just how it went, you know? Mm -hmm. Because, like, my concern when it comes to this, because this happens a lot, is Mm -hmm. they'll change up the timing of the back air to where sometimes it auto cancels and sometimes it doesn't. That's usually the constant mix-up I see is that they'll do one or the other. And it's right, still right. hard timing me except to catch on because if I'm not in range to where I'm like super close to Falco when he's in like yeah, cancel Yeah, exactly. Line, it's still hard for me to punish or I have to respect it as is because yeah. I'm just not in range. And an auto cancel is auto cancel. You can't really, right, you can't really right. do that unless you have perfect spacing. Yeah, exactly. So what, what was he tried to do is he tried to time an aerial slightly after falco's you know he, he's not trying to punish him he's not trying to punish this he's not trying to punish that no he's just trying to make west block here as best as possible you know mm-hmm. he's just trying to take his turn that's all he's trying to do is take his turn mm-hmm. you miss something i'm gonna take my turn i'm not punishing you i'm just taking my turn with an aerial so like, i think so west lands and then now it's yeah. wizzy's turn wizzy's turn right but the only issue is west you know, West, West, you know, I mean, he was just like slightly off, right? Mm-hmm. If Wizzy maybe jumped a little earlier and got this back air off, it would have been his, he might have, he might have like hit West or, or made him block, right? Mm-hmm. But, you know, it was close. It was a trade, right? Like, yeah, it's, it's still a back The, the idea is there. Trade. Yeah. Uh, obviously, it sucks to get up tilted there, but I think Wizzy did the right thing, you know? He took his turn. Wizzy just picked, or Wes just picked a good option there, you know? Mm-hmm. It happens. It's and, good melee. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So don't be afraid to take your turn. You don't need a punish there. Just take your turn. Mm-hmm. And make sure, you know, you're in position to take your turn, you know? It doesn't need to be, like, backer into tech chase zero to death. No, it doesn't. If you can get him to block after he misses, that's totally it, fine. Then, you know? it, then is that the ticket when to try and commit or apply pressure? Yeah, exactly, yeah. Because then he's going to start getting used to the flow. It's like, okay, I missed something, but was usually ready to, 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 to you know, to pressure me after, you know? Mm-hmm. So, yeah, you, the, the thing is, like, you can't be, get caught on trying to punish that back here. You just have to try to take your turn as best as possible, you know? Okay. Four throw. Oh, my Ooh. God. That was hilarious. That's that's the non-stomp, non-stomp yeah. H-box in there. <laughs> Oh, if we, how many times have we seen this situation before on the back air thing or on the yeah outside? yeah is that it, happens yeah is it just like since it's early it doesn't really matter it's just wizzy got got there pretty much yeah wizzy got yeah he just read him you know but like um yeah i, I do want to see like i don't know I is wizzy actually he ready to di this up till um get oh you go a little farther back a little farther back okay. That's when. Oh right wow, that's so crazy. Because that was tip near spacing. That was tip near. West's up tilts are just fucking good, man. Go back. That takes a lot of control for the Falco to do that. I want to see to... just frame by frame on the up tilt on yeah. what Wizzy could have done. So. All right. Cause look how late this up tilt is, dude. Yeah, like Wizzy's already committed. Yeah, but think about this. Think about how good this is for Wes. He mm-hmm. takes his time, turns his character around, and mm-hmm. then does an up tilt. You know, it is really good. And was this like this wasn't in between the hits? That uh, I mean, it wasn't like complete tip near spacing because Wizzy was fading in. Yeah, but the exactly. Still that's stands. true too. Yeah. Would Wizzy could he have done just like way dash forward shield? potentially to like close i, I think so yeah I, I think that's totally fine way dash forward shield hold down forward and uh grab that's possible yeah he's he's um, outside the percent where he can he can't asdi it down so that's yeah. unfortunately not an option where he can just ASDI oh that's it. true huh? okay he's at if he was at like zero to like 16 
Yeah. Um, he could do that and just mash grab. I've, yeah. I've been able to. Nun does that a lot, and I've been able to do it a few times as well. Mm. Okay. Yeah. And also, the trade here means is Wizzy's taking his turn at the, at the at the right time. You know, mm -hmm. like enough to where like he's getting a trade. It might not be the perfect nair. Yeah, it's but nair, enough if to nair where, trades at zero. Yeah. So like. Even if you're not punishing that, you want to look at how you're getting hit by the up tilt. Are you late? Are you is the up tilt just straight up beating your move, mm -hmm. or you know are you trading? You know, and that gives you a lot of information and be like, okay, yeah, maybe I need to either do it a little quicker or it's not possible. I need to wait for the up tilt to finish or something. You know? Yeah, and like in trading, it's like it's almost like even though you traded and you may have lost the trade, it's still not a bad choice because yeah, it usually means one or the other. It, yeah. g it still gives you information is what you're exactly. saying. Exactly. Yeah. He's ready to tech it, which is really nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, he tried DI. to DI. Man, these light offs are insane. Really good. Oh, good nice. patience. I want to go back to that. So <laughs> I want to see how Wizzy avoided the pressure right. So he like does like a cross up nair. So this is something in the past. I studied yeah. this with West Balls. Um, I forgot which set it was. I think it may have been a Johnny set or it may have been another Wizzy West Ball set. But mm -hmm. what West Balls like to do is that he does he does some sort of aerial and then he does a cross up with either a uh, or yeah. a back air. And this is yeah, another really one of those good. examples where West does the cross up. So I think he does an air here. We'll see. Yeah, yeah he does a cross yeah. up and then he does an up till afterwards. Yeah. Um, <laughs> what should I, I think do, about this? Like, considering I think up? Think about this. Remember we talked about earlier, it's okay to hold shield longer, mm -hmm. right? Like, until they represent grab. Mm -hmm. You know? And, like, uh, this isn't, like, airtight pressure, you know? No. Right? He's so, just crossing up. He's just crossing up. So, you're fine, you know? Like, it's always good to hold shield sometimes a little longer just to see if they're going to commit to grab. Or It's different, obviously, if they're shining your shield a bunch, but, like, you know. Just hold, just, just, just chill, right? Just, you know, there's get no that, need to commit. Yeah, there's no need to commit, especially early in the game. You're still getting information. Like, you don't have to jump out of shield right away, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, everybody's expecting Falcon to jump out of shield right away, right? Mm -hmm. That's like the default. It, so, is, is it kind of just goes back to the concept we talked about long ago, where it's make them exhaust their options? Is this like yeah. a similar sort of concept here, where yeah, we wait for to sure. see, it, like in the feeling out phase. We see what kind of options they're showing. So in this case, like in this case for West Balls, what he showed in his options, it was he's gonna do a he's gonna do a cross up nair into an up tilt. That's already some information. Yeah, he's already gonna do move into up, move into move like pretty pretty consistently, right? Yeah. So holding shield just seems like a smart thing to do. Yeah. You know? Yeah, because he's doing aerial into tilt or something. Yeah. That's so. Nice. Yeah, good dash hands in there. Nice down, Great tilt. down yeah. tilt. Nice setup here. So this is a little uh, greedy by Wizzy to do that back air. Why is it greedy? I'm just curious. Because he's at 91, and he doesn't have to double jump here. Um, I felt like he had so much good center control already. You know. Mm-hmm. Like he didn't, I don't, I feel like he didn't need to do this, but I guess it's like a pseudo read where he's like, Wes is just gonna maybe laser or nair in, but Wes has been pretty good about keeping his back towards him, you know. And this is the back but, turn I sort of talked about. Obviously not full yeah. hop, but it's still like the back turn. So like, should I just be facing forward at Falco at this sort of like percent uh, juncture instead of like I, trying to back air? Yeah, I, th I think so. We just have to look at the Falco first, because I don't know if Wizzy was actually looking at Wes, because Wes is pretty much... Yeah, he tries to stop. That I think the stop is not bad. I don't think it's a bad Yeah, stop. I don't think it's bad. But then he like he he's up here, right? And he sees that Wes is like pretty actionable. Mm -hmm. He might be, he might have been just looking for a trade on something, but mm -hmm. you know, looking for a trade at 91 is like... It's not ideal. You're probably sent off stage. You're probably sent yeah. off stage. Yeah. Like, even well, so, he gets hit. I want to see how far he goes. Yeah, yeah he's, he goes just off, right. he's just off stage, so it doesn't really, it doesn't really make yeah. sense. Yeah. But, you know, it's a, if he hit that back there, good for him, you know? Mm hmm That uh, was good. Look at that double jump. Mm hmm Was that a laser sound? Let's see. Remember the, the up airs? 
Yep, the up air. Late up airs, how important those are. Mm -hmm. It's important because now we can block. Yep, up air to block. Because every other aerial is too laggy, right? Mm -hmm. You can't block in time. Yeah, I've been doing this a lot more uh, versus Fox in particular. Is it just yeah. is it the same sort of concept applies here? Just up yeah, air to yeah. block? Yeah, up air to block, up air to whatever, you know, just like... It's just the safest aerial for Falcon to fish with. Everybody thinks it's Nair. It's not really Nair. It's up air safer. Mm -hmm. Nice. Patience. Yeah. Patience on the block. Patience on the block. Patience. He Thumbs doesn't. Up. He doesn't do. Uh, he does a roll this time. Yeah, I guess he messed up, but or something. Yeah. What? Wizzy's keeping it very tight into center. Mm -hmm. And he's just looking for like these small up airs yet. Grab. Oh, he fucked it oh, up. That's fine. Up, yeah. he's fishing with up air. Just fishing with up air, right? Mm -hmm. Look how many up airs Wizzy's just doing. Just fishing. Yeah. Wizzy's still playing this really well. Yeah, there is oh, an up air. Trade. Yeah. Oh, barely missed. Roll. Fine. Nice. Ooh, he does. Right, notice how. He notice how he doesn't one. fuck with Falco at that back air range. Mm hmm. Look, right? That's the deadliest range, right? Falco just back airs there. Yeah, they're gonna back air. They're gonna stuff almost anything. It's like yeah, it's either back so air or up tilt. Yeah, but look how much patience he has. He waits for mm -hmm. it, you know. Yeah. And then he like just gets away. He doesn't try to nair here. That's a, the very every falcon would try to nair here. Every falcon. Mm -hmm. You know, but no, he's like no, it's fine. I don't want to go for that trade. I'm gonna back out. You know. Mm -hmm. Okay, and he tries to get another trade back there. there. Doesn't work. Doesn't work out. Yeah. He has a better present this time. That's the thing. But he yeah, like he's at a combo percent. Yeah. And then like to go back to that situation, like which one? Uh, just uh, the the uh, back air up tilt situation. Oh, okay. So, um, I think it's right. Yeah, right here. Yeah. Um, is it just best to just like? Can I try falling up air? Uh, do a falling up air on this, or is it better just to like empty on? Like, what should I do like while waiting out? Because I feel like I should still wait. Like you're here in in shield. Uh, in shield, and also when I'm just like standing there. Um, I mean, I think you look at Falco, right? You know he's in perfect back air range. I don't think the up air is. You could do like a short hop up air and try to maybe trade here but um i don't know i i just there's not many good options here you know mm -hmm. i like to just wait it out thing you know wait out full jump no wait out wait out for falco to back air here okay yeah and then then you make a decision yeah because he does the full uh the full jump double jump yeah yeah he knows he can't fuck with falco there you know mm -hmm. but this is really impressive for West to get in position to back air again there. Nice. Oh, what the oh. hell is that nair? Yeah, that was not a that was not a good nair. Yeah. Well, how many up airs was he do here? One. Yeah. Oh, oh. That's sick. There's the latest thing. So I want to go back to this real quick. So, you remember how we talked about with, like, you know, there's double jump out of laser stun? Yeah. And this is something, so Space Pitch and I have talked about this, actually, where, mm -hmm. you know, sometimes you're just not going to be able to power shield it. Like, sometimes your power shield is just not going to be on point. Yeah, So, what yeah. we talked about is having an option tree for each one. So, we'd have, mm. like, uh, an option tree to where if you regular shield it, you know, what do you do? And what okay. happens, what is your option tree when you power shield it? And then what is your option tree if you just eat the laser? You know, do you double jump? Do you dash out? Mm. You have an option tree for each scenario. Yeah. Like, and I just want to mention that, like, this is one of those situations. No, that's, that's, yeah, definitely one of those situations, yeah. Um, yeah, so now it's interesting. Wes is starting to know that Wizzy doesn't want to fuck with him anymore. So now he's kind of just lasering, and we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm. Full jumps. Wizzy's... Roll. Yeah, full jumps, playing it patient. Trying to avoid them all together. Full jumps. Yeah. He's not really fucking with the lasers at all. Yeah. Beautiful. Look, oh, this yeah. is good. Look what he does here. Look what he does here. Hits him. Hits yeah. him. Knows he can't follow up. So what does he do? He dashes away. Goes to center. Mm -hmm. That's super sick. 
think about that. Like, just because you hit somebody with an up air here does not mean you go like ham hey, here, right? No, especially at this he percent. Just, yeah, so he goes into center immediately, dude. That's so crazy. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Yeah, and so. Grab old back one. Yeah. Interesting. Nice. Oh, where is that? Back? Ah, nice. nice. That's classic. Yeah. Uh, just think about how many up airs he's going for, like when Wizzy's at, or when uh, West is at like mid high percents, right? It's like almost. It's not. Possible. It's not just the up air trade. It's not just like the up air versus down air thing. It's just like even the grounded up airs, right? Mm -hmm. It it's a yeah. good move to put out because, I mean, the hitbox is big, and then like even. It, like you said, it doesn't have to be the downer trade. Like it's just it's a good threatening hitbox because if Wes gets hit by it, he's probably either knocked off or yeah. put in a really rough position, whether he's you know, he's in stun and he's in a tech situation or yeah. he's just pressured because the move is just sharking under him. Or like yeah. like there, where it eventually leads to a stop in the up air. Yeah, yeah. Alright, so they're both shielding. I guarantee you Wes is gonna do something first, right? He's gonna try a shield drop, I think. Yep. Yeah. And Wizzy knows it. Mm -hmm. Falcos always want to go first, man. They always do. They always want to, right? Just keep that in mind, you know? Okay, so just, like, no matter how defensive they are, they want to go first. They usually, right? They usually want to go first in, in those, like, situations. I guess and then now the question asked, what do you, uh, because this will come up, mm -hmm. what do you do when they don't want to go first? That's a good question. Um... Uh, I would go for, like, delayed aerials on shield, like a late knee or something, or even just, like, a uh, dash dance slightly out of their range. Mm -hmm. So, you know. But that's a, that's a tough situation. I mean, that's, like, that's really testing their reactions, too, you know? Mm -hmm. So what you got to do is you got to be, like, if you're not going first, you're waiting for me to do something, I'm going to move around and look like i'm gonna do something but not really you know so like kind of like, toy so like toy with the range to yes see, toy to, with the... to see if they actually if they go if they still are going to go first exactly or, or to see if they give you a ticket to where you go first instead yeah exactly yeah so yeah that, from that situation you, you yeah you you play around with the range and you'd be like okay are you are you waiting for me to enter that range if you are i'm just gonna go around it i'm gonna wave dash around it whatever uh, dash dance around it, you know. Um, you know, just keep that in mind. Yeah, you don't have to hit their shield, so because mm -hmm. they're just waiting for you to hit their shield or so, to go go into that zone. So it becomes like a game of cat and mouse in a sense, yeah. where like, are they it, like? I guess the question would be, are they going first or not? Is that like exactly the to answer? Yep, that's a good question. That's a really good question to answer. Yeah, so, and most falcons will be going first, but yeah. So okay, so like basically. If they're, if they're going first, react accordingly. If they aren't going first, figure out uh, figure out what to figure uh, out when they want to go. Yeah, you know? figure out when they want to go. How close do you have to get to them to want to go? You know, are they just going to laser out a shield mm -hmm. when they realize that you're not going to come in? You know, yeah. because a lot yeah. of as weird as it is, a lot of Falcos that play the West Ball style, they just mm. don't want to go first these days. Like, mm, interesting. I don't Falcos just don't like going first. Yeah. They'd rather wait it out. Like only, only a handful I have seen. Just given the on the level I'm at, they will want hmm. to go first. So and I want to just like that's why I want to ask that question because I'm like no, that's a good question. Like, uh, when, when you see, don't want to. yeah, that's a good question. And when you see an example of that, let me know. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll watch a set, or even I could probably just rewatch my Bobby set to see. Okay. Like I'll I'll find okay. an example and just message you it. Okay, yeah, that'd be perfect, yeah. Oh, that, what the fuck was that Spanish DI? Oh. Um, you see that? <laughs> fucking went behind him. He fucking went behind him on a down air. Wizzy's insane. That's a good grab from Wes. Yeah. Oh, oh that, my god. That sucks. That was really good. Oh, that, look that at was, this, look at this. That was really good all around. This whole interaction was really good, except yeah. for Phantom. So think about this. He's in that dreaded range, right? Yep. The back back or up tilt range. What does exactly. he do? Shields. Shields runs mm -hmm. away. Not worth. Not worth messing with. Not worth it. You know. Great power shield. First one. Yeah. Ooh, nasty up tilt. That was really good. 
Wow. Ooh, Insane was he? Going for that up air. Nice. I really like this. Look. Mm -hmm. The up air. Take, he takes his turn. He just takes his turn. Mm -hmm. He doesn't try to force the issue. Takes his turn and goes into center, you know? Yep. He has stage. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, okay. Yeah. wizzy has been trying to work that, you know? Is it's he been, trying it to works. Trade? Yeah, it works against up tilt. Doesn't really work against back air. Mm -hmm. It's like a risky thing for Wizzy to do, but like, especially at been... that percent. Like at that yeah. percent, like, it's just not ideal. Like, basically, Falco's in favor the entire time, regardless. Yeah. Like thirty-seven he... versus one twenty-seven. Yeah. Wes is down to take that all day. Yeah, Wes has been really good about that. A lot of people will. Ass uh, a lot of Falcos might later there. Because, mm -hmm. you know, but like, Wes, is, Wes is just good at this matchup, you know. He's not laser in there. Mm -hmm. So, he just... So... Ooh, ooh, caught the shield drop. Yeah. Great oh air Oh, my dodge. God. That you was shouldn't... such a good air dodge. Good mash. mash. Wow, that was a really good mash. I like the four till option. Yeah. Oh, uh, what the fuck? He tried to tack it. Yeah. Up airs here. Oh, nice jumped double out jump out of laser sun. Yeah. First time we've seen it. He's gonna get it again. He goes to plat with it. Yeah. Wizzy's just playing safe and center. Good nice rolls. rolls. Back hit of up air. Oh, he tried it. He tried it. Yeah. Right here. He was yeah. a little off. He was a little late. Yeah. There it oh, is. Got That's it. the trade he wants, but he got it yeah so, like i want to see that. that's so, the trade he's looking for but it's like it worked there it like it works but like you know it's not it, it's not, there are better options you think i think i think it's good to go for you just see if it works but i mean west could have easily got a clean back air there right like mm -hmm. it's just really close it's hard to tell i'm not saying don't do it it's just like if you lose that situation, you got to be okay with it, right? Because you, you know. But why is it so good? Like he, he's always has his back turned right at the edge of the platform, like right there. He's always, always ready, dude. Yeah. He's always, like. He w he wins like almost every trade in that situation. Yeah. That's crazy, dude. Yeah. Um, I I want to just write down the notes from this game alone. I mean, I feel like this sure. game alone already dropped a ton of information. Yeah, that's really good. So like. Uh, the first one being is, um, uh, how does Falco go for, uh, is like go first or not? Or like, yeah. How, yeah. How, just, how to phrase it. How, um, basically Falco's will usually go first. Falco, so, um, Falco's will usually go first. Yep. In that, in that kind of like stalemate situation, you know? Uh, in stalemates um stalemates and then react uh react accordingly uh react accordingly uh accordingly yeah when so just remember the, the power of holding shield right yeah when so and um figure out when or when not, when they don't yeah exactly figure yeah. out when they when they want to get out of shield if they're if they're going if they're going second right yeah, and figure out um, when they want to go, if uh, when they want to go, uh, if they do go first. I'll be right back. Okay, there's a couple other ones I'm trying to think off the top of my head. Uh, go back to like the beginning of game two. Let's. Um, yeah. There are, uh, couple, there are a couple others just from that game one. Alone. Oh, well, yeah, take your turn. Take your turn. 
when when your turn is there, take it. Yeah, when your turn is there, take it. You don't have to punish. Your uh, turn, when your turn is there, take it, and I'm all right. Uh, I'm all right. Take it, and then right doesn't need to be a punish. Exactly. Yeah. Doesn't need to be a punish. And then uh, there was like one other one that was really good. It was like uh, it was about the the full hop thing. Oh, stay out of that zone. Just stay out of that zone. Stay uh stay out of the Falco zone. Yeah. Because I think and it's just, a good name to call it. Just yeah, stay but, out of the Falco yeah. zone. And uh, just remember, when you're staying out of the zone, don't only stay out of that zone with dash dancing, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, full hop there, and then just uh say it again. What you said. Uh, don't only stay out of that zone with dash dancing. Right. It's got to be other movement too. Don't stay out with just dash dance. Yeah. With just dash dance and I, I i'm trying to think is there any more from that game alone um, um like there's the nair situation that we talked about well, that, that that was less related to just holding shield a little longer okay so i'm gonna write hold shield a little long so yeah. what will hold shield a little longer um what should i write afterwards to hold shield a little longer? um and you know I mean, because think about it. There's, there's, there's a difference between holding shield versus shine pressure, and a difference between holding shield from like up till yeah. pressure, right? So it's like, yeah, like hold shield a little longer versus like aerial yeah. up tilt stuff, yeah. Versus aerial, because you can have. You're, I mean, it's not, it's not airtight. You can, you can, you'll, 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 you'll find a way out of aerial up tilt. It's not airtight. You just got to be a little patient, you know. Yeah. Not as airtight, uh, not as airtight as shine pressure. Yeah, because I, because like, I have come to the conclusion that there is such a difference. Yeah, there is. That, yeah, but you know, in the zone, in in the moment of the game, you're like, oh, I'm under pressure, you know. But like, there's so many gaps in up tilt, nair, and aerial pressure, right? No, you can sometimes just hold shield or just like full hop out of it. Yeah, exactly. So like, it's just. So pretty much just like here's why I, I guess to run down because that game one dropped so much information. It was a lot, yeah. Like that actually dropped so much knowledge. So to run down game one alone, it's a uh, Falcos will usually go first in stale uh, in stalemates, react accordingly when so, and figure out when they want to go uh, go if they do go first. Yeah. Um. When your when your turn is there, take it. Doesn't need to be a punish though. Exactly, yeah, it doesn't have to be punished. Um, stay out of the Falco zone, full hop slash back air. Don't yeah. uh don't stay out of the zone uh stay out with just dash dance. Uh yep. I'm gonna just write do other moves. Do other yeah. things. Because mm -hmm. that way I'm gonna just give myself freedom to like figure out what other things I'd wanna do there. And then uh yeah. hold shield a little longer versus aerial slash tilt stuff. Not as airtight as shine pressure. Is that good? Right, yeah, that's good, yeah, exactly. Okay. Perfect. Uh, <laughs> that's enough for a game one. Holy yeah, that's a lot. Like that... But it's, like, so interesting because, like, these two... Wizzy's not gonna get gimmicked, bro. He's just not, he, you know? He isn't. It's just like, I'm not scrapping with you. You gotta earn this shit, you know? Like, and that's... That's really what I want in this matchup mm -hmm. because... I'll just be honest, this is my least favorite style to play against in the game. And mm. I'm like, I, and what I want to do is, I want to make these, I want to make Falco's earn it, but then also, like, you get to expose Falco's game plans when they try that sort of strategy. Exactly. Because then you get yeah. to see, do they have another layer to that? Because, yeah. if I'm being honest, a lot of Falcos do not have that layer. Right, yeah. There they you go. Not. There you go. And that's usually what separates the good Falcos from the great Falcos, is that they add that extra layer in. Yeah, exactly. And I've, no. I've noticed I've lost a lot of those Falcos that don't really have the extra layer, and I'm usually mm. just moving to the first thing, where it's like, okay, if That's I get, very th good if I get through that. this, then it's wide open, and then I get to actually see how good are they actually. Is it just this strategy, or is there so much more to it? Yeah. Perfect. That's amazing self-reflection. That's good. Okay, let's watch game two. TLDR. FD. I love Wes picking FD. Yeah. I think Thor Falco should pick FD. As a TLDR, fun. though, fuck Falco. <laughs> yeah. Oh. 
Yeah, Eddie yeah. definitely the right pick. Uh, yeah. He just he okay. just nared right into it. That's yeah. exactly what Wes wants. Yeah. Oh, good. hang on, the Smash DI. Go back. Yeah, crazy video of Smash DI right, right here. Right here. Boom. Such good. He just rolls out. Yeah, that's, that's good. That's good. That's good. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, he's not. Wizzy's power trip right. is not on point. Think about why he does this. Why does he do these full jumps here? Um, to usually avoid the lasers. Avoid the lasers, and it gives him his shield back. Mm -hmm. Right. So he's saving his shield. Do I do in a full full hop? Right. Which is really good. And he just yeah taking his time. Good block. Help. Look how yep. long he holds block here. Mm -hmm. And guess what? It's not aerial type. You notice that there's it's not aerial, right? So there's he's okay. A, there's always he's a okay. little bubble. There's almost like a bubble around Wizzy. Like so, yeah. like go back to when he's shielding. Right about uh, so it's when West comes in. Right, right here. So like go frame by frame. So he gets the uh, he throws a jab, yeah. and then watch him turn around. You notice yeah, that there's okay. always a little bubble there. Yeah, there's like about there's yeah. about like two to three character lengths between yeah, him and he, Wes. Yeah, he really knows that that back air there. So he knows that like back air can't reach here. So he's like, they he just waits, takes his turn, mm -hmm. and gets out. Right. There's not really much of a threat Wes can do. Like maybe yeah. fade in back air, but that's still so much space for Wizzy that like. Worst case scenario, he can wave dash back or like yeah. eat the eat the CC or something. Like exactly, it's pretty much a yeah. winning situation because Wes has given him the space. Yep, yep. Look at this patience. Just yep. jumps, jumps back, right? Yep. Fade back and watch. Wes comes in. Is he gonna yep. roll? Rolls yes. Out. Look at this full jump. Just ch chilling. He's chilling, and he tries to walk. So that's the adjustment. So watch. Wes' adjustment is. He does this block. Look, you see this. Yeah, small he's looking for that up till. It's a yeah. timing mix up. Yeah, it is. No, that's really good. Yeah, that's really good. Noticing that. Wow. The grab. Oh. Oh, this is Wizzy Central right now. And I, oh it my works. god. It worked that time. Yeah, it worked that time. That's crazy. So, I guess the question is so, I mean, we talked about it earlier. Well, Wes could have done back here there, right? I mean, he could have. Uh, so, I mean, he ledge dash on. He did the turnaround up tilt. Yeah. I mean. Okay. Well, that okay. We we already know that back air can trade with that up tilt, right? It Which can. is fine. Yes. That's it a can. good trade because you're probably not going to die off that up tilt, mm -hmm. right? So, if Woody's going for that trade, back air versus up tilt trade, that's that's cool, but mm -hmm. it's also risky because, um, you know, Falco can back air it, right? Is it similar? So we've talked about this a while. You remember how like knee can trade with up tilt, and that's usually pretty good to do. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. Is it's... it a similar concept to that? Except this time it doesn't trade. Wizzy just wins because he he was able to avoid the move itself. Yeah. No. I. Yeah. Exactly. That's exactly it. Yeah. So if he. Yeah. He, if he's banking on it, basically, it's like there's a two like a. Yeah. There's two mixups going on. It's like is he gonna back air or up tilt? Is he going to. Um. You know, but yeah, basically, is he gonna back her up tilt, right? And so, if he up tilts and he trades, it's not the worst, right? No, it's not. It like it, it's and at this percent, like, yeah. I would say if up tilt usually wins here, I would say. Up yeah, it probably wins. usually wins, but yeah, the 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 quality of the combo is not scary, right? Usually, if you can get it, if you can di well enough, you know. Mm -hmm. So but, it's, that's a good calculated risk, right? Yeah, like it, it's definitely like a calculated risk to where like if Wizzy loses the exchange or trades with it, he yeah. knows at least like what he's getting into, if that makes yeah. sense. No, that's what it's exactly that's so true. Yeah. So I mean obviously Wizzy's Smash is insane, so he might even yeah. be like, I'm ready, I'm ready. Yeah, I'm it, it's basically it's, Dar it's, it's basically Darian's like, go do this because I have the Smash GI ready to combat this. Yeah, that's fucking crazy. So that's basically that's actually really that's like psychologically genius. Yeah, that is. Because it really basically genius. means like it's basically saying he's basically daring him to do it because I have a, a, a echelon of my play that can combat it. That's actually yeah. super next level. That's fucking crazy, dude. That's so sick. Oh, hang on. So hang on. I want to see how he ledge bashes on. I want to see what Wizzy does. So he does downer this time. Yeah. Full hop. I mean, not bad. 
rolls yeah. out and it, you notice that that was the first time we'd see him do the shine pressure yeah that was the first shine pressure thing which is kind of crazy you know Wes is still not ready to catch wizzy's rolls no he hasn't i think it's like the first time wizzy is like he did an instant roll the time you notice that he's been waiting each time yeah. This well, yeah, I guess. Instantly. Yeah, that's the power of holding shield then, because if you hold shield, people don't expect you to roll right away, right? Mm -hmm. And now, so, and now with that case, he's rolling. Yeah, he's rolling. Well, yeah, I gotta say, Wizzy's out of shield game is really underrated. It is really underrated. It is Basically, super it's underrated. That's a good point because he's not gonna find the crazy nares and aerials that S2J does. But no, he, it's not a Johnny style. But he definitely will not get hit by stupid shit. It's like that's the one thing I've really got is that Wizzy's out of shield game is actually not that bad yeah. at all. Let me grab that's just typical wow. point GX stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> he just outscrapped Wes him. Wes looks so dumb that entire stuff. Yeah, he just outscrapped him, but playing simple. Yeah. Oh shit. Look at full jumps. He's never done a high laser. You notice that? No, he hasn't, he has which not, is weird. He, it's been all horizontal. He has never done one high laser. Yeah. I'm a little, yeah, it's kind of weird because Wes should be running under, was he, you know? Either running under or at least full hopping to try and combat it. Yeah. Like, I mean, look at this. Like, Wizzy has yeah. all the air in the world for free. Yeah, he's playing 64. Exactly. It's literally 64. Nice. I don't mind that. He's going for mm -hmm. sneaky nair. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh my. That was well, okay. Wes, Wes was wa waiting for that 100%. Oh my god. he That's so funny because we are like, he's held, he held shield for like the first two ones. Uh, that's like the most like smash thing ever. The most like Falco thing ever. Yes. Yes. Yep. Two. You're not going to do it again. You're not, you're, you're not going to be that degenerate. Really? Yes. He did, th he did it three times in a row. Jesus <laughs> Christ, dude. <laughs> And that's why I hate. That's why I don't like this style because literally, yeah. it's like, it's it literally is that psychological battle. Is like you're not gonna do that that many yeah. times. But then like have some respect for yourself, bro. The, the audacity of West Balls to say I'm going to do this three times in a row. Yeah. Because like I don't think what Wizzy did was bad there. I don't think it was. I no, think I don't just, think so. And this is where I think like with the style, it's that it is kind of degenerate. Is that like it's almost like. He's not going to do it three times in a row, but then he does. Yeah. Like, what would be, I guess, like, I guess if in the case, how should I combat this? Because you know there's going to be the Falcos that have that audacity to do that. Like, yeah, well, how should I combat it in this case? In, when in that situation, that you just wave dash back out of shield and then punish the next up tilt. Okay. Yeah. So just, like, wave dash, wave dash back. Should I try anything else? Should I try, like, maybe attempting to grab if I'm in the spacing for it? If you're in spacing, yeah, that could work. Like, because just inevitably, these occasions are just going to occur. And I just want to know, like, when it does occur, when I, I call it the stupid shit. When he does the stupid shit, what do you yeah, do? Yeah, the stupid shit, yeah. You just we just you just get space and, and punish the next thing. If he whiffs it again, you punish it, you know? Okay. You just dash grab it. Does it just become, like, wait and bait or just whiff punish in that case? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. And if you don't think you can whiff punish it, just don't, you know? I mean, just go back to... Can I go just to go center. to ledge even? Like Yeah, you can go to ledge. So like, yeah, I wanna go funny. back real quick and see the spacing. On where um uh go back a little bit. So right here. Right here. So he he does the stupid shit. Can yeah. I just way dash back and just go to ledge? If yeah, happens? way dash back, yeah. That's because fine. this is way in the range back. to where like it's okay to go to ledge. Yep. Totally okay, yeah. That's God, Falk was so fucking stupid. <laughs> 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 I just had to say that. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's the first time he's done the full jump like that. Yeah, this is the first shine combo he's gotten. Yeah, literally the first one. Yeah. I mean, that's the thing, though. Like, that's why you pick FD, is because you just... Wes isn't going to win neutral. He knows he's not. Mm. But with the, with, the way he's, with the way he's playing, he's not really... Yeah, you see, he's got to, like... He's, he's going for the combos, which is fine. You know, if he knows himself as a player. I'm not going to beat you in neutral that much, but if I hit you... You're gonna take seventy seven percent, you know? Yeah. So so like, so like in this case, like when they're like this sort of combo, like when it's this sort of play where they're gonna get just like I wouldn't say like you expect them to get this type of percent, but just like you get what I mean. Like they're gonna go yeah, for yeah, the, exactly. they're gonna go for the big percent. 
Yeah. Like, should I just, like, try to match that in return? Or just wait for my opening to grab, like... I think you just wait for your opening, you know? They need a shine, you know? They mm-hmm. absolutely need a shine. So, as long as you don't give them the shine, it's fine. If you okay. give them some trade up tilt or whatever, that's fine, you know? Okay, so basically If they play... have to tech chase you for it, that's fine, but... So basically just, like, play to, like, force them to try and see if they can get a shine on you? Exactly, yeah. Yeah. Because it's the first one we've seen. Yeah. And it was because Wizzy messed up, so... Yeah. And it's like, I mean, given the juncture, I mean, it's fine. Yeah. Regrab. Oh, oh you missed the dash. Wow. Late down... Okay, so that's the adjustment. Late down air. Yeah, late down air. Yeah, cross, down. Up, cross up shit again. Oh. Yeah. But he jumps out, and it's a bubble again, except this yeah. time it's a back turn bubble. Yeah. And West decides to up tilt, and he gets punished for it. He did his back air this time, so. Yeah. Ooh, wow, oh, my what, God. What a push off. You see that? Yeah, that was crazy. Ooh. Oh, yeah. West falls packed it. Yeah. Oh, really? Ooh, he West? Him. I don't know. What the hell was that? Go, hang on, go <laughs> back. Go back. I want to see. I don't know why he did that. He just. Jumped on top of Wizzy when he was invisible. That was bad. <laughs> yeah, that was that. That was really bad. I don't I'm not going that, that was bad. Uh. Ooh, got out. Yeah. What the fuck? Don't try it at home. Died. <laughs> don't try that at home. What the fuck was that? Just Falcon kicks. Uh, I don't think we'll ever see that. Oh. Yeah. That was. That was so fucking juicy. Holy yeah. shit, that was oh, so juicy. Yeah. Oh, nice jump back. That was the type of nair that combos in anything. Yeah. Nice. We talked about tech roll one many times. Oh my god. That was so good yeah, all around. That was so good. Yeah. I want to just go back to him. I want to go back to how that started. So, go back a little bit. Um, um, a little bit. Like back, that, back when he's at like zero, I want to say. So... He does the full hop. Uh, first, don't try that at home. He does the lay down air again. It's facing away. And then yeah. I want to see what he did to get that near. Uh, oh, he just caught... He, did he, he caught him jumping. Yeah. yeah he, he just caught be, him jumping. He just beat him to the jump. Yeah. Fucked up the chase haze. That's fine. Oh, he tried grabbing. Yeah. Back air shield. I, uh, okay, so I want to see the back air. How'd he get it? He just does it. Uh, do, I want to see frame by frame it. So right here. Uh, one, two, three, four. He didn't jump squat. He's trying to jump. He's trying to jump. Yeah. Okay. So he caught him jumping. That's what he did. That's the second time he's caught him jumping. He first caught him jumping with the nair, and then he caught him with the back air. Yeah. And then we can just go from here. I love... We've talked about that so many times with the roll in. Yeah. yeah that's that was good. also fucking good. Oh, we got got that time. Yeah, we got lucky you didn't die there. Yeah. Nice full jump out. Look at this. Mm-hmm. Not... We'll it's across it, right? Still in yeah, that bubble think... range. That time, you noticed that it was an early jump out? Yeah. You remember how, like, usually he would wait for it for four, but this that's time... That's true. He... Usually he would wait, yeah. So, like, go back again. I want to see it again visually. Uh, a little before. Right here. You notice it was yeah. instant. Usually it was such an early wait. jump out. Usually he'd do it before, uh, he'd do it later. This time he did it early. Yeah, that's true. Oh, oh, big grab. Just up there. Oh. Uh, eh. Okay. It was close. Decent punish, not the best. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. shields again. Holds the shield. Patience. Holds he's, the shield of he's patience. He's mixing it. He's mixing it. Yeah, he's mixing it well. Grab. Oh my god, you can grab that. Chase. Oh, this is just the whizzy stuff. Oh, it fucks up. Missed it that that DI was fucking nuts. What the fuck was this DI? Off this back air. Oh, Look at that. Oh, Did you see that? Oh, that's weak hit back air. What the fuck? He went behind him off weak hit back air. What the fuck is... Holy... What Look the at fuck? that shit. What the fuck? That's insane. Uh, know, greedy bro. stomp. I understand it. I understand the greedy stomp. It's too low. Yeah, I, yeah. I understand the stomp. He's trying. He's feeling confident. Yeah. Oh, he tried it again, but it was yeah. doesn't oh. bite. Back air. Yeah, he's good. 
Okay, Dang, so Wes got destroyed. That was like I really like. So I do like the adjustment for Wes. You notice that he pretty much gave him full respect. Yeah, he gave him a lot of respect. Like I want to go back because that was the first time where he didn't put out a back air or an up tilt. Wizzy just went and did it. So that's true, huh? So he goes and dies. So watch the back air. Right here. You notice that Wes, he, he did yeah. the full jump blazer. That's the first time he did it. Yeah, that was the first time he did it, yeah. Fortunately. I'm not going to lie, Wes is kind of getting really fucked up this game. Yeah, <laughs> this he entire did really set. Up. So I guess, like, to now break it down again, what was the kind of the main takeaway from game two? Um, From game two. It was the back air trade. It was the back air trade. Yeah, back air trade. So back air is just gonna, yeah, you you got you're okay with trading with up up tilt to get the back air. Bear trade. Uh, so, how's right? Uh, bear trade with um. With up tilt, you're okay with. With. But you have but but you you have to be okay with getting beat by back air. If you're going for that, you have to be okay with getting beat by Falco back air. So okay, so my phrase like this: bear trade with up tilt. If you're okay, um, if you're okay. If you're okay with the risk, yeah, of being so, beaten out, exactly, yeah. And I'm not even gonna just write up tilt because you can get beaten out by up tilt as well. Yeah, so yeah, you like, could. Oh, yeah, of being beaten, uh, of being beaten out by both. Yeah. Um. By bear smash up tilt because there are times where you're just gonna lose out to both. So and I'm gonna write calculated risk because it is yeah. a ri it is technically um it is technically risky what Wizzy is doing it is uh it is a yeah. risk but it's a calculated risk because Wizzy knows the consequence because if he loses the situation he knows what to do accordingly so like um is that sort of just like the concept yeah that's just the concept yeah yeah. It's like it's like when you um, it's another character. Oh, it's like when um, for example, if I'm Marth and I just get lasered, I, if I jump and forward air, uh, Falco. No, if I if I die if I try to dash back into a laser, and I get uh, down aired or something, I'm like I'm okay with it, because I'm like. You know, if I get this dash attack. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah, it's like if I get this dash attack, it's like. It's still okay. Yeah. Like, it, you know. it's not the worst thing in the world. Like, you're still kind of in, like, in the Falco combo zone. But, like, yeah, you yeah. at least know what's coming. Like, you know the general flow chart that he's going to yeah. do afterwards. Exactly. As long as I don't get shined, as long as there's a punishment with shine, I'm mm -hmm. okay. You know? Okay. And then, um, yeah. what would be the other take? I guess, like, abuse full hop until... Yes, that was yeah, that was beautiful, right? Play it like sixty four, right? Yeah, a, Just... a beautiful hop, like sixty four. Yeah, like sixty four, until yeah. they full hop themselves. Yeah, until they yeah run until under you, they... etc. Yeah. Full hop or contest themselves. Is there any more? I feel like there was a couple more. I think I think um, now they were all related to the holding shield stuff. Mm -hmm. I guess like, yeah. but um, just think about how how slow this game was. Mm -hmm. How like, I, I, what, how long was that game? I mean, that's it was still... a three minute game, but for FD, like with these like with these characters, that's pretty slow. Yeah, that's pretty slow. You mm -hmm. know, usually it's like and usually two and minutes. I think West just got a little mad at the end, so that's why it went faster, right? Mm -hmm. But until the last stock, it was so slow, right? Yes. So think about that. That's that's like okay if you want to play at that pace, you know. So I guess just like. Should I write that down, like, play the slow game, or no? Yeah, play the slow game, yeah. I think that's a really good note, because it's like, you're in more control than you think, you know? If you don't, if you don't run into Falco, it's gonna, he's gonna be, he's gonna have a hard time opening you up. If you don't run into him, right? So play the slow game to control the match? Yeah. Ba yeah, basically. Play the slow game, avoid shine, right? Yep. And then avoid, uh, avoid shine. Yeah. Like, I, the... I noticed that, too. He did not get many shines. He, right, right. He just he, played outside. He, like you said, he played outside of. He, he, he knew his bubble. Yeah, he knew. He the didn't bubble. fuck with it, you know. 
He didn't he didn't get inside the Falco zone or the Falco bubble. Yeah. And then um I think the last thing is like should I just mix uh mix in early uh, should I write this down at all or just leave it as is like mix in early jump out of shield as well or should uh, I just leave you don't have to I mean that's that's like a good note, but I don't want you to get like overwhelmed. Like if you want to put that in there, cool, but like okay. don't make it like a main note, yeah. Okay. I I'll probably just leave it as is because like yeah. I can just use just trust myself to adjust to that accordingly. Yeah. Because like that's just that's just a thing that like that just you you just catch it's like okay they're catching me late then I go early. Yeah. Okay. Game three. It's probably my last game, unfortunately. Mm. Right out of time. Got some other stuff to do, unfortunately. No worries. Okay. This is a game. Uh. Was he lo lost? Yeah. Nice, good back air. Oh, nasty combo. Oh, full jump. Wow. Two. Oh. Nice. I think that roll was accidental. Mm -hmm. I yeah. didn't. Tech I don't know yet. why that move is so hard to check. <laughs> oh, <Yeah. okay. laughs> that happens. <laughs> How did he get that shine? Yeah. Just chases him down. Wow. Yeah, laser shine. It's like it's the first time he like. Only he actually chased him down. Yeah. Him. First time. Yeah. But well, this is rough. Oh, he got out. I guess that's what messed this up. Full jumps. Well, that's the adjustment. Now, oh, he he shine grabbed. Mhm. Mm first time he's first done shine it. Shine grab. So he can't hold shield as much. Oh, before. like, no way. This spaghetti. Shit's not Oh wow, up tilt. Yeah, he didn't hold shield there. Oh, the meter really missed. Ah, oh, come on, he rested that. Nice. Watch well, is adapting. Mm -hmm. Full jumps here. Yep. And so that's here. the adjustment. So what do I do when this happens? Like um, when the when, so what uh, so, what's the counter when they full jump? I would say, uh, like wave dash down in place. Okay. You know. Or wave dash where you dash down, yeah, that's totally fine, yeah. So, we dash down. Wave dash down, run under is totally like a, a pretty good default option. Or run, uh, run under. Yeah, you could go for the trade up air, but like you probably won't be ready for it, you know. If they start full hopping. Mm -hmm. So. If they start like really catching on, yeah. Okay, so wave dash down, uh, down slash in place or run under if they start if they start full hop adjusting right. yeah. nice. oh, oh my god what the fuck you kidding me all right but look at this full jumpers full jump he waits and he waits he waits falcon cannonball yeah that was insane that was actually insane Okay, good recovery. Oh, how did that down air win? Oh, I like the tech away, but what's the hatch is on? Yeah. Nice. Oh, that was her sick forward air. Oh. Goes to ledge. Nice, goes to ledge. So smart. Full hops. Save Wait. shield. Oh my god. Wait, this, this is, is crazy. so this is so smart from Wizzy. Yeah. All of this is so smart. Oh, oh what? We're there. Barely gets him. Oh he waits. Grab. Oh no. That was so unforged. His DI is okay. insane. How did he live? No, what are you doing? Hang on, go back. Oh, how did, did you just let go early? I want to go back and see. Huh? Go back. What is? What are you doing here? So fucking kick. He just fucked up. Yeah. And then he grabs him. Oh, the shame. So late. That was Dude. so smart from Wizzy all around. Yeah. It's like everything we talked about. Yeah, pretty much. He's just applying. Yeah. Good full jumps. Full jump. And you Wes know, is not adapting. Wes is not running under. You notice also, look at the zigzag. You see, honestly, he fades back in and watch. He fades in with the snare. It's a yeah. zigzag. It's a, so that this is crazy. something Hbox is good at with Puff, but it's nice yeah. seeing it with Falcon because I know Falcon can do too. Yes. I call it zigzag drift. Wizzy zigzag. That is a zigzag. Drift. He zigzag drift. That's yeah. so smart. so nice i love seeing the zigzag draft it's so, yeah. something that just doesn't get seen a lot with falcon yeah. 
that's what you notice. What, why, why is Wes so timid here? Look. He's just firing he's the so, gun. Like, he's so, like, it's weird locking. because... But he's not crouch canceling either. No. Look, you can't be afraid of Falcon here, right? He's no. at 176. 76? He's just missing his shit. Yeah, Wes is spooked, bro. He's scared. Full hop, jabs. Wizzy's fine with that. Grab, that's yeah. okay. That's okay. Wizzy has full event. This is Wizzy's control. Nice. Good. I love the action Oh, come there. on. Wes, please don't lose this. Wizzy <laughs> is outplaying him at every turn. Yeah. Oh, you oh, good trade. Up there? Oh, no. That was such a good trade. Oh, get the meaty ass shine, though. That's such a good shine. Oh, this combo is insane. What the fuck? Oh, nice. Barely. Oh, Ooh, I like the idea. I like the idea. Yeah. Nice push. Wait, wait. Oh, he finally caught on. He waited. Oh, that was good. good. Stuff. I want to go back to the back air. You notice how he back air traded? So go back to like 0%. Where? Right here. Watch. He yeah. traded. That's where the trade works on the down air. That's where the trade works, but I mean, yeah. West still won the exchange. Like, is it worth. It's probably not worth going for, but just. No, I think it's worth going for. I mean. He was at 0. Yeah, I think it's worth going for. I mean, I thought West probably still had a little bit. Or. A little, I thought he maybe thought he had a little bit more of its ability, mm -hmm. but yeah. This okay. entire stock is insane. Yeah, it's pretty insane. This down was good. Yeah, that was a really good. Okay, now I want to see game four because, like, you're seeing just everything kind of the concept all together. That's nothing really yeah. new. Like, are you fine with watching the final game or do you have to really do Yeah, it? we could do it. That's fine. Because, like, there's I don't think there's really game? anything new. It's is there just, one more game going? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Oh, wow. Just gets a random size up shine, dude. Nice roll out. Good patience. Let me jump back. Oh, oh the there trade. it is. Jeff, yeah, there's Jeff, a trade. Jeff Knee and oh, it traded. Oh, my God. That didn't. It still works. Yeah. The case. Oh, that sucks, man. You just got caught by wake up shine, yeah. dude. Oh, not the best. Kind of a greedy oh, stomp. Dude, this is. Oh, he just fucks up again, dude. That, that sucks. That sucks. He Wizzy just... basically did everything. He. Yeah, it did everything right. definitely could have won his... that game in every yeah. way. It's unfortunate. Right. Uh, how so... long does Wizzy wait? Nope, not too long. Okay. I like this uh, green lane right there. Green lane. I think we pretty much got everything we needed, though, from that game three. Yeah. Because, like, the only thing really of note that I noticed... To, like, just oh, look at this. Yeah, pa pause for one sec. Okay. The only thing I got from game three was wait dash down slash in place or run... Okay. Yeah, or yeah. run under if they start full hopping, full hop adjusting. Yeah, pretty much. I don't think there's really much that came from it otherwise. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I think we can stop there, though. I think that was good. That's a lot of information. Mm -hmm. um, maybe I'll just watch this game quickly, see what happens. Full hops. Long for stock. Oh, my. oh, what the fuck? I guess it's a good problem to have because we had so many notes because this this set unpacked yeah. so much information. And I think yeah. like at this point we kind of understand what's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we got Jeff it. Knee. But yeah, yeah. I think I think All we're right, good because like Wizzy eventually wins out. And I think we kind of yeah. see where. Yeah, we see the concepts. Yeah, okay. we see the yeah. concepts. And I think it's already good enough as is to uh just as a whole so i guess like i don't even need to really summarize it. i think just the okay. notes i had are yeah. already good like i may just watch this game on my uh, on my own and okay. jot it just jot down some notes from it but we already have like the general concept of like how the flow of the set has gone yeah definitely but I'm I'm probably not even gonna do like an overall recap because I think like yeah, yeah I think these, we got it yeah these are good enough as is because I'll just read them yeah. back. It's okay. Falco's Luigi go first and stalemates react accordingly when uh when so and figure out when they want to go if they do go first. When your turn is there, take it. Doesn't need yeah. to be a punish. Uh, doesn't need to be a punish though. Stay uh, stay out of the Falco zone. Full hop slash back air. Don't stay um don't. Oh, don't stay out with uh with just dash dance. Do other things. Yeah. Hold shield a little longer versus aerial slash tilt stuff. Mm -hmm. Not as airtight as shine pressure. 
that's all from game one alone. Um, yeah. Bear trade with up tilt if you're you're okay with the risk of being beaten by down air slash up tilt or excuse me, uh, bear slash up tilt. Uh -huh. uh, it's a calculated risk. Abuse abuse full hop like sixty four. So basically abuse yes. full hop like sixty four until they full hop or contest uh contest themselves. Play the yeah. slow game to uh, control the match. Avoid shine. Uh, avoid shine. Yeah. Uh, that's all from game two. And then game three, it's wait us down slash in place or run under if they start uh, full hop adjusting. And then game four, I can honestly just look at my own, look on my own. I think okay. like okay. we have the concept so run at this point that it's really just like it's just adjustment adjustments because yeah. pretty much yeah. The, the game plan is so set in stone with this set that yeah. it's not too much other than just seeing what adjustments needs to be made mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but i think that that uh, because i was unsure about if it was, i want to do this set or the mango set but we could just do the mango one next time because i think we got no, okay. so much information from this set alone because this style of play has been the achilles heel of mine for a while and i yeah, think this, I this just unpacked so much like this actually helped a lot yeah. in how this matchup works. That's true. All right. All right, that was good. Yeah. Um, and the stream you're picking. Now. You're picking some really good sets, and you're asking some really good questions too. Thanks. All right, I'm gonna stop the stream now.